I'm Sir Tap Tap, and this is Circles. It is a puzzle game based on circles. I don't entirely know how it works, but uh, I guess I'm figuring it out. Uh, review card this game was provided by the developer. <laughs> this is my first time playing. I guess it kind of just is like, hey, figure out what to do. Oh. I'm kill. I guess it's kind of like one of those old flash game, like move the mouse around, like the floor is lava sort of things. Oh, we finished the set of levels. <laughs> I like it when puzzle games, oop, kind of integrate their whole being into the uh, into the puzzle. Like even the even the interface is part of what we're doing here. That's kind of that's really cool. Um, gives it. A lot of style. Ow. Okay, so just don't touch the circles. That's all you gotta do. That's right, Parker. I see you about to jump over here and ruin everything. I see it. I see the impending ruination of all of that I hold dear. Ow. Ow. Huh? What do you mean? Huh? Oh, they kind of grow back. Oh, okay. I like when puzzle games have a lot of style to them. Like, like it's kind of hard to get into the old, um, you know, that rather cliche at this point, um, indie platform puzzler, and you know, you get emotions, and the emotions, you know, let you double jump. Ooh, colors. I was a fan of games with good. Uh, there we go. Nice use of color. Mix things up. You know, strong colors, lots of contrast. Uh, I forget if I mentioned a review copy of this game was provided by the developer. I always um, try to bring that up. Ow. Um, I like the looming music. I'm not sure it's necessarily related to the that thing getting bigger, but it certainly fitting. There we go. Yeah. Okay. More colors. I love things that change palettes. Like, like palettes are really underappreciated, huh? What? What? Oh, you just gotta move fast. Okay. It's the Sonic level. Um, <laughs> I really love games that, like, Okay, now you gotta move slow. I like games that don't really need a tutorial. You just kind of figure out what to do. That's that's one of my favorite kinds of puzzles. Just kind of figuring out the game itself is in fact the puzzle, and uh, everything just flows naturally. Sometimes that can be difficult because you know, what if you get stuck? Sometimes you know, that's an issue. But um, like uh, this is reminding me of um, Moo Cartographer. That was a game where, like, just figuring out the interface was, like, half of the puzzle. Okay, so, gotta go fast. Oh, dead. Gotta go dead. Oh, wait, no, is it timing-based? Okay. So, like, the theme changes every, like, set of levels, so to speak. Oh, wait, wait. Wait, no, maybe it's direction. If you go down, those things go down. Okay, it's direction. Okay. I think puzzle games are at their best when there's like a new mechanic almost every few levels. Okay, so going horizontally. Okay, that's tricky. Oh, wait, wait, I see what's going on. You gotta. There we go. Cute. Right, is there like a boss level at the end there? I'm a little. There we go. A little not unsure of what's gonna come here. Oh, oh! I don't know what's happening. What is this? Oh, we're in World 2! <laughs> Neat! Okay. Ooh, more colors. <laughs> A Unicode circle is the achievement that I just got. Oh. 
Am I not in the level yet? Okay. <laughs> I really like this one. Um, alright. How do I... How do I shrinky-dink this, though? I don't think the mouth... Oh! Oh! I'm stupid. Duh. Okay. Yeah, and this is just played entirely with the mouse so far. There's been no... I don't have to click anything. It's just mouse movement. And uh, I would assume this would work probably on a PC with a stylus too. Maybe not touch. I'm not sure about touch really. I guess it depends on how... I enjoy having a touch PC. I have a Surface Pro 3. Uh, some games work just fine. Some games don't. It's really... It's kind of hard to tell. I'm not really sure what exactly makes the difference. Uh-oh. Okay, so it just kind of throbs. Ow! Ah! Okay. No. There we go. Okay. I like the little cleanup at the end. It makes it feel... It makes completing a level feel just a bit more cathartic. Boop. I like this music, too. It's got almost like a, um... Like, I could hear this in the background of, um... Pink Panther. And that's not... That's not a sound you hear too much in, uh, in games. I'm not sure if even the Pink Panther game had music like that. I had... There's a Pink Panther game for SNES. It is terrible. Do not buy it. Um, this was back before I knew that licensed games were like... Huh? I don't understand this. I just gotta go fast again. Okay. We're back to that then. Gotta go fast! Ah! Okay. Okay, I understand. Huh. <laughs> okay. What's this? Oh, you gotta balance... You gotta balance the speed up. So close. Let me slow up my mouse a bit here. Oh. Even slower. There we go. Having a having a DPI toggle. Very useful for that particular level. Ow. I love the um the little drum beats of, uh... Okay. I wasn't entirely sure what happened, what's going on there, but... I got it to work. Ooh! Colors. So I just really like colors. Um, not enough games have... More games need colors! Like, what the hell, man? It's okay to have colors. Let me tell you, if you're, if you're a game developer and you're making a game, it's okay to put colors in there. It's 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 okay. Even AAA is kind of embracing colors, isn't this? Did I did I not just successfully complete this? Oh, did I accidentally repeat or something? I'm I'm confused. Wait, what? Wait, what? No. Oh, dead. Okay. This is the same general concept, but you have to be... You have to... Ow! Ah, oh, come on! Okay. You gotta... It's a stealth section. You gotta... You gotta be right up... You gotta be right up in their grill. Okay, right as it starts to recede. There we go. Just barely. Alright. Okay, so this whole, like, segment of four is, like, different challenges. On this theme! Ah, oh, what? Alright. Oh, this is a segment of five this time. Oh, I see. 
You just gotta constantly be moving and sneak yourself in there, I guess, this time. Oh, come on. It reminds me a teeny bit, uh, mostly visually, of, uh, what, what was that game called? That, like, peaceful, like, bullet hell dodgy game, um, um, Split Body, or what's that? Hang on, this is gonna bug me. Uh, soft Body, Soft Body. Yeah, that was really cool. I should go back and see what they added since I finished. Uh, I beat sort of the, the pre-release version, but I didn't. Oh, we're back to the meeting things up again. There we go. Oh, oh! Not quite. Nope! I really like the music in this one. It's very relaxing and classy. And, uh... I don't know, just not quite the music you usually get out of stuff. There we go. Okay. Ow. Okay. That's well, another balancing act. There we go. I really like how just the movement feels very organic and like even just selecting levels just feels like part of the game. It just all feels very natural. <laughs> it's kind of hard to talk when doing some of these very specific motions. Uh oh. Okay, so. Not quite. Now as it's receding. Ah! Ow. Okay. You don't want to be in the way of the big one. Ah. I gotta kind of cha chase it from behind, I guess. Ah, come on. cat is making noises. I do not like noises being made that are not me. Um, I am the only one allowed to make noise. Oh, it's gonna be really close. Oh, yes! Okay! Woo! Alright, world three! Woo! Wait, what? Huh? Oh, so this is a puzzle, in fact. It's a boss puzzle. Wait, what the... Oh, okay. Now, getting out of the world wasn't its own puzzle previously. Alright. I got food in the oven, so I think we're gonna wait. <gasps> wait, what? Wait, what? What is this? What does that mean? Oh, it rotates as you move. There's different, like, mutators. Oh, that is really cool. But wait, hold on though. Hold on though. I actually just want to go back. How do I go back? Okay, escape button. Is there options? Oop, that is not how you options. That that is closing the game. Thank you. <laughs> Oops. I just wanted to see if there were options. The game starts with I It's hard to record. Um, in fact, I don't, I don't think it's recording it at all. Um, the, the little thing, there you go. Um, it has a cute little actual circle as its little, like, intro thing. But, uh, I don't think you saw that. What is this? Oh, that's just close and minimize. Okay. So not really any options, just... Okay, I want to turn that off and I want to go... Uh, this is okay. We're back to world three. Okay. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm gonna call it quits for this video I think I want to finish this world and I guess there's more mutator like Yeah, now I'm curious if there's even more to the game beyond like world four or is it like Four extra modes and I guess you can mix and match the mutators like That's interesting. I I don't think I'll play with all of the mutators on because my head will explode and catch fire but um, Yeah, this is circles and I'm really digging this